Broncos fan? Diehard Broncos fan. Always have been. When's the last time you've been to a game? Uh, because of COVID, probably about two or three seasons now. Okay. okay. Yeah. Did you play ball yourself? I did play football. I played, okay. uh, played in Montbello High School. Montbello High School? Yes, sir. Home of the Warriors, right? That's right. You got it. Tell me about your family. Me and my wife, her name's Tiffany. We've been married uh, coming up on nine years this year. Uh, we actually known each other almost 30 years now. My grandmother used to keep her when we were kids and no just came full circle and we started talking back in 20, 2010, on and off. She was she was shading me, you know, she wouldn't give me no play and <laughs> finally she came around, you know, I was able to reel her in and, you know, four kids later, here we are. So uh, I have Joshua, Josiah, Jaden, and uh, Alexandria. My son Josiah is actually in heaven. He, oh. he didn't make it. How do you relax? I, I work out before I go go in every day, just to kind of ease into the work week or into the day. And then uh, I like to I like to barbecue. I get down on the grill, some ribs. I get down on uh, smoke some chickens, some turkeys, you know, briskets, you, uh, you pulled pork. Slow and low with the smoke. Yes, sir. This shirt right here is uh, my fraternity. It's uh, Phi Beta Sigma Incorporated. Uh, we were founded January 9th, 1914 on the campus of Howard University in Washington, D.C. Uh, so we stand on the principles of scholarship, uh, service, and brotherhood. Long family history of, of fraternities and sororities, are you the first? Well, my mom, she's uh, what we call Zeta Phi Beta sorority, and that's my fraternity's sister uh, sorority. And so what they would call me what is called a legacy. So yeah. because, uh, you know, she's the sister sorority and I came in in the uh, brotherhood of the fraternity, you know, we're linked, so. Yeah, you guys are constitutionally bound, constitutionally like, bound. To, to each other then. Yes, that's, that's correct. That's fantastic, that's fantastic. I, I, I think I saw your mom and you um, serving at an event one time, is that right? That's correct. What other types of services or things do you guys collect and give away? One of my fraternity brothers, uh, Sean Bosley, he has an organization called Feed the Streets that's local here in Denver. And uh, he does different events monthly to where we're, uh, we partner with him and we go out and we pass out food to the homeless, we serve food to the homeless. So just, just another way where we can, we can give back to our fellow man and to our community. If I'm around a bunch of my brothers and brother will yell out, blue, five, the rest of us will be like, you know. So that's, that's kind of our thing, that's our thing. <laughs> Yeah, but signals and, and... Oh yeah, that's that's our thing right there, you know. We so out there repping, doing our thing. That's, that's, how we, that's how people recognize us. Let me see them uh, waves. All right, Maybe. so this is a wave check. So, you know, I, I'll kind of show you what, 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 what we got here, you know. <laughs> Very high maintenance. Not as much as a female, but it's, it's definitely high maintenance. I mean, brushing, making sure you rag up every night, put your do rag on. Uh, Colorado being dry, you got to make sure you keep it moisturized. So it's 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 a lot of upkeep. I was getting kind of tired. <laughs> 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 Drumming my pain with his finger. One time. I've seen the Chevy with the blood of five dope. Son is a habit. Yeah, that's David Banner and Chris Brown. Oh yeah, DMX. Y'all gonna make me lose my mind. Oh yeah, that's that old school Temptations. You know the words? I got sunshine. Oh man, that's Flow Rider. I got the King Surf King Supers commercial to it now. <laughs> To reap it. I respect, they put some respect on it. Uh huh. Oh, yeah, that's that journey. You put this on at a Bronco game, people lose their mind. That was Zap and Roger, no bounce. You knew that one, Craig? Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's that careless whisper. Don't, don't judge me. Kirk Franklin. <laughs> <laughs> Stumped. 
stomp. Yeah. You remember that. Or no. No, that's it. No, Revolution. Sorry. Oh, that's Revolution. Oh, this one. Earth, Wind, and Fire. September. You got that. You got Rain. that. That's, 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 that's my dad getting this up Saturday morning clean. <laughs> I, 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 I go grab the broom now. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. You got it. Oh, yeah. Fred Hammond. Hallelujah. Let's just take it Jesus be a face. One, two, three, say. Oh, yeah. We you know this song? Church. Yeah. You grew up in church? Oh, yeah. Tell me about that. So, just growing up in church, man, um, you know, my, my dad was a preacher. Not a pastor, but he was a preacher. My mom, same thing. And so... You know, we, we were in church all the time growing up, you know, Sunday, two, three services sometime, you know, throughout the week, Bible study, choir rehearsal, you know, everything, youth night. So, you know, growing up in the church, I mean, that's 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 like, uh, I mean, that comes with the territory. I mean, you know, Fred Hammond, uh, uh, Kirk Franklin, so. It takes you back. It does, and definitely. And then, so, I mean, even me, myself, I, I served in the church as a deacon, you know, just um, taking care of the congregation, praying for people, visiting sick people, you know, just whatever, whatever is required to, to serve God's well, people, you know, so. It seems to be a, a, a long history of, of service and taking care of, of the community. Definitely. I, I love that. I'm Chris Jones and I'm Thornton PD.